Hello. Hey, kiddo. Good. I'm glad you answered the phone. Okay, so I'm out here at a random roadside park reading cards, and Jason's been helping me out, but I'm sure he's sleeping, so can you do something for me real quick, please? What do you need me to do? Okay. On my reading table back in my room, there's a wine glass, and there's some cards in that wine glass. I need you to tell me what is after the death card. Okay, one second. Okay. It's madness. I'm not sure what she's doing, but this sounds really fun. You said after the death card? Yeah. What a great view. Sometimes I forget how beautiful the world is. Hey, I can see the hierophant. Thank you, Taurus. All right, I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye bye. Bye. Okay, so that's a fun way to start the readings out, right? I mean, hey everybody, this is Faith from Firesign Tarot. Hope everybody's well. We're reading for Taurus. I am out here at a random roadside park because my house is super duper crowded and I need to be able to think clearly and not be distracted and this is like the perfect thing, so okay. But this reading will be for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. It is your free will to be whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it is your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay, too. You can check your Moon, Rising, your Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid, and all things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And our dear friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here at the Fireside Tarot Table. Everybody's always welcome, and I appreciate you stopping by, taking time out of your busy day to come hang out with me in my car at a random parking lot. Random roadside park. Out in the rain. Um, a pretty gnarly storm just went over with the when I was doing the Scorpio reading, so we'll see if another one rolls over. I think it might have cleared up for a minute, I don't know. We got some, that way is west, and we definitely got some crap coming, so we'll see what happens. Anyway, before I do the invocation and throw your cards down, Taurus, there are some things we need to go over. One, never make a life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. I just don't recommend it, it's not a good practice. Two. And by life-altering, I mean if it's going to destroy your marriage, make you lose your job, you know. Tear your family apart, you know, life-altering. Major, huge decisions, don't. Don't. I don't recommend it. Okay. Two, if it's not your reading, not your story, not your message, leave the cards on the table and walk away. It wasn't meant for you. We'll have better luck next time. All right. Heavenly Father, Mother, Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for July 2021. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with us today. I appreciate you. I'm grateful and thankful for you. Let's bring Taurus to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. One more shuffle. Another Snapchat. Hmm. Taurus, why are you here? Justice. Okay. Card of Libra. Might be a Libra involved. I don't know. We'll see what the rest of the cards have to say. What happened? Knight of Cups. Hmm. Who came rushing in with a cup? Water energy. That's a shiny cup. There could be lots of wonderful things in that cup. Hmm. Okay. What was in the cup, Taurus? Death. It's transformation. 
It's like when the chubby little caterpillar goes into the cocoon and comes out a moth. You know, it's transformation. It's change. It's all it really means. Something evolving. Could have been a spiritual evolution. Could be a Scorpio you're dealing with. Again, we also have Libra on the board. And this changed you. This caused a change. Okay, what's going on right now? Seven of Cups reversed. Confusion. Okay. Hmm. All right. Why the confusion, I wonder? What's coming in? Nine of Wands reversed. Not forward movement. <clears throat> or the party pony could be hanging up the saddle. I don't know. We'll see what the rest of the cards have to say. I hate how these seats are angled. I have to bring a board next time I come do this. I think I'm going to do this more often. It's quiet. It's peaceful. I don't have children running in and out of the room. I don't have domestic partners and adopted children knocking on the door needing random trivial things. I can actually get stuff done in the car. Wow. It's amazing. Five of Cups reversed. Coming out of a state of sadness. Okay. What about the other person? What's the other person's energy universe? Talk to me. Talk to me. That's two. Only want one. Oh my goodness. Come on. Page of Cups reversed. Hmm. There's been a level of the playing in field and now there's silence. Has the silence caused the confusion, Taurus? Hmm. That's a mighty sword Lady Justice carries. A mighty sword and heavy scales. Hmm. What's up with that? Okay, so the Page of Cups brings in the Nine of Swords for the other person involved. Okay. That's a lot of sleepless nights. How does a cup of love bring in sleepless nights? I'm so confused right now. I'm so confused. What is going on? All right. Nine of Pentacles reversed on top of death. Somebody got clingy. Somebody got a little clingy. Somebody got a little clingy, maybe got a little weird. Possible. Could be financial codependence for some of you. Could be emotional codependence. It's a card of codependence. Two of swords reversed next to the seven of cups for the current energy for the person you're dealing with. An impossible decision, no communication, and you're confused. Who leveled the playing field? Wow. Taurus. This is sketch. You gotta let me know if somebody's getting this because I'm all kinds of confused right now. I don't have Taurus anywhere in my chart, so... I mean, I'm sure I have some house in Taurus, but you know, it's not like... It's not like in my in my top three, top five. Nowhere. All right, why is the Knight of Wands reversed here? For the future? Or, uh, yeah. Posing at the other side. Empress. Oh, wow. Taurus, you hanging up... Is the party pony hanging up the saddle? Because they view you as the catch. You make the cat meow. Wow. Okay. You make the stars shine. They see growth and potential. There's growth and potential on their end. All right. I mean, that's good. 
So we just gotta get through the confusion, right? Hermit reversed. Coming out of a state of sadness, going into complete isolation. Or coming out of hermit mode. We'll get clarity here in a second. What? This is why we get clarity, friends. This is why we get clarity. All right. Universe, source, spirit, and guides. Can I get clarity on the cards on the table for Taurus, please? Taurus, sun, moon, rising, Venus. Oh, wow. That is a great big cumulonimbus. I am so glad that is east of me right now. And it is going away from me. Because that is what just went over. And I'm thinking the other side of town is getting hit pretty hard with some rain right now. Huh. Oh yeah, there's some spikers coming. This is going to be interesting. Sorry. Sorry. I love storms and weather. And one of my favorite things to do when I was a kid was um, chase tornadoes. Yeah. Fun stuff. We used to pile in the car and, you know, sometimes chase the storm, so hoping we didn't get in front of them, but we used to go see, like, the devastation, and it was good times, you know, good, fun, clean family togetherness back in the 80s and 90s, you know, before internet and all that happy jazz. All right. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. July 2021. One more. Why is justice here? Thank you. Eight of Cups reversed. Okay, so you're coming back. You going back? That's a card of return. Going back to level up, level a playing field. Give me one more. Okay, I'll take two. Nine of Cups, Page of Cups. Wow. Oh, wow. Either you're thinking about it or you're doing it because you're almost there. That is beautiful. You want to give him a cup. Aww. That's ten. You returning because they make you happy? Okay, well their page of cups is reversed, so now I'm super intrigued. You won on the Page of Cups reversed. The lovers. Oh. That's so precious. They feel the connection. I think they're afraid of the... They might be a little afraid of the cup. Why? Why? There's a choice. Lovers. Two of Swords reversed. There's an impossible choice here in regards to this cup. Why? Give me one. Give me one. Give me one. Give me one. Queen of Cups. Okay. There's emotion there. Lots of freaking cups. They have emotion for you. Too many. Try that again. Mm. 
the chariot. It might be distance. I'd have something to do with distance. There could be a huge distance between you. It could have something to do with the direction they want to go in life. I look at the chariot as a card of choices, too. Because you're kind of being pulled in two different directions. They're kind of being pulled in two different directions. There might be a choice between two people, but I'm not seeing that on the rest of the board. It's not yet. All right. Why is the Nine of Swords here? No, wait, hold on. Why is the Page of Cups, the Knight of Cups here? Why is the Knight of Cups here? I thought that was the page, but it's the Knight. Why is the Knight of Cups here? Why is the Knight of Cups here? I'm going to take in five cards. Give me one. Give me one. Give me one. Okay, I'll take two. Ace of Cups reversed, Six of Pentacles reversed. That's what hung them up. That's what put them all up in their head. That's what caused the sleepless nights. Ace of Cups reversed, Six of Pentacles reversed. I think that cup got jerked back as fast as it was handed over. There's no equal give and take here. Or the cup got dumped. If they dump your cup, everything's not equal. Somebody's cup got dumped here. Why is the Nine of Swords here? Why is the Nine of Swords here? I'm not taking three cards. Give me one. Why is the Nine of Swords here? Thank you. Seven of Swords reversed. Just, ooh. Okay, truth. Truths of the matter. One more. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'll take three. I'll take three. Gosh. King of Swords to a cup strength. They felt the connection. They held back. Why is the King of Swords here? Ace of Pentacles. Small, slow starts. But the small, slow starts of abundance. This doesn't explain why they're all up in their head. Why strength? Why strength? Why strength? Why hold back the world? Something else had to come to an end. They were ending something else. Something else was still closing out. Why the Two of Cups? Why the Two of Cups? Why the Two of Cups? Thank you. Ten of Pentacles reversed. They couldn't. There's something they couldn't give. There's something they weren't ready to give. That's why they were holding back. Small, slow starts. But that was all they had. Why death? Why death? The Fool and the Wheel of Fortune reversed. This changed you. Why the Wheel of Fortune reversed? Why the Wheel of Fortune reversed? Why the Wheel of Fortune reversed for Taurus? Thank you. Five of Pentacles reversed.
You took a leap of faith, but it wasn't time yet. Taurus, I think you were missing somebody a little bit too. Why the Five of Pentacles reversed? It flipped back down. Eight of Swords, Hangman reversed. You were in process. You were in the process of an evolution when you met this person. You had stuff you hadn't closed out yet either, but you took a leap of faith. But it equally consumed you. Because you were still in process. Why the Nine of Pentacles reversed? Why the Nine of Pentacles reversed? Star reversed. Why the star reversed? Ten swords. That's why they clung on. That's why they clung. That's why they got clingy. They feared the ending. They didn't they didn't think they were gonna get what they wanted. They feared the ending. Why the Ten of Swords? Queen of Pentacles reversed, Knight of Cups reversed. They felt like they weren't good enough. They felt like their cup wasn't good enough. Oh. Wow. Hold on, people are yelling. I'm gonna pause for a second. Okay, we're back. They finally, like, left and stopped talking and stuff so all right i got the windows down where were we ah the seven of cups reversed taurus's current energy okay seven of cups reversed why is seven of cups reversed here four swords there's confusion so you're just taking a break you're taking a minute you're trying to sort things out in your head possibly Probably spending some time with your guides, whoever your higher power is, king of cups, emotionally withdrawing from the situation. Okay. Pardon me. Okay. Or attempting to, because there's a whole lot of emotion up there. It's like you want to come back and level up. They make you extremely happy. But in the, in the midst of this confusion, it's a lot, a whole lot of cups. It's a whole lot of cups. You're probably dealing with water or somebody with water in their chart. Okay. Why is the two of swords reversed here? Hey, I don't want 20 cards. I don't want 20 cards. This little bitty deck and my big fat hands. Let me tell you. Why is the two of swords reversed here? Okay, land already. It kind of landed weird. I'm going to say Ace of Swords reversed. They're silent. Might not have anything to say. Might not know what to say. The Empress came out again, though. Oh, they think you're the catch. They know you're the catch. They don't know what to say. Nine of Pentacles. They might enjoy being single. Maybe they're trying not to be as clingy. Maybe they're trying to be less codependent. Four of Pentacles reversed. They might be letting go. I don't know. They might be letting go. 
We're trying to let go. All right, what's this Knight of Wands reversed in the future for? Six of Swords. That's not hanging up the saddle. That's not moving. Not moving forward. There's Six of Swords in the upright, though. You're moving with something. What's this Six of Swords? King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles. That's stubborn energy. That is extremely stubborn energy. Working on you, maybe? Magician manifesting what you want in your life. It flipped out, flew out. Nine of Rods, Seven of Cups. Rising up amidst the confusion. You're wounded. This confusion has wounded you. This confusion has done messed you up. But you're rising up. Might be moving on. They still see you as the Empress. You are still the apple of their eye. You still make the stars shine. Why is the Empress here? Two swords, two rods reversed. Nine of swords reversed. Justice. They want to sleep better. Still at a bit of a crossroads, though. They can't let go. They can't move forward. I think they're making up their mind. They want to come in and level the playing field. One more on that. One more. One more on that. They hate the pentacles. They want to work on it. They want to work on it. They want to try to put energy to it again. They want to try to fix it because you make the stars shine, Taurus. You make the stars shine. I think they're coming out of a state of fear and anxiety. You're still confused, though. I think... <laughs> It's in the future. Time is fluid, guys. Time is fluid. Just keep that in mind. They could come back. It might take them a minute to come back. And you might be confused as to when they come back. Because they might not come back until you have moved forward. I think you're still processing. Why is the Five of Cups reversed here? For an outcome. Page of Pentacles reversed. Why the Page of Pentacles reversed? Another half hour reading. All right, it fell. Four of rods reversed. No, five of rods reversed. Coming out of conflict. Coming out of sadness. Coming out of conflict. King of rods reversed.
you might just be like, you know what? I'm not moving forward with this. Offer's off the table. But I don't want to fight with you. Might be less drama. You don't want no drama. Knight of Rods reversed again. Not moving forward. I think you're good. I think you're going to be good. Hermit reversed. Why is the hermit reversed on their side? Death. Moon reversed. Illumination. Transformation. One more. Six of Rods, High Priestess. Wow. Lit a fire under somebody's ass. Gonna be lighting a fire under somebody's ass. You're gonna cause a transformation in them. This whole situation is gonna cause a transformation in them. They might go like deep permit for a minute. But I think this, this series of events has definitely shined a light on them, for them. One more. I'll take two. Here, from reverse, two of pentacles. So they can regain balance in their life. Maybe they can see the blessing. All right, let's get some advice. Let's get some advice. Some about reading in the rain, man. Somebody walked up. Had to put the windows up. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Do not sink energy into things that will not be abundant. That you know will not be abundant. Wheel of Fortune. Five of Pentacles reversed. Don't look at the ending of a cycle as a bad thing. Sometimes when cycles end, it brings us out of a dark, cold place. Endings aren't bad. Because endings bring about new beginnings, friends. Seven of Pentacles reversed and the Ten of Rods. Don't let waiting on something become burdensome. Eight of Rods reversed in Temperance. And sometimes, sometimes it is best to not communicate until the energies between you are civil and balanced. So, if y'all are in separation and things aren't even civil right now, you might want to weigh this out a minute. <laughs> okay? Just give it time. All right, Taurus. Thanks for coming down and hanging out. I appreciate you wholeheartedly. It's like 8.30 at night here. The glare is probably killing you because the sun's starting to shine again. So, wait a minute. Is that west? The sun sets in the west, right? I am, like, all discombobulated here. Then that way is east. That way can't be east. I'm all kinds of turned around. I'm not on my home turf. Anyway, I don't even know my coronal directions right now. Any, oh, yeah, that's right. I turned the car around. I forgot. No wonder. Okay, I love you guys. Don't mind me. I'm scatterbrained. Take care. Be blessed. Thanks for coming by, and I will catch you later.